whip it in for another Bikers Night Off. I'm Paul Johnston. He is indeed, and I'm Wayne Kershaw, and we've got a right bunch here tonight. Top teams we've got this week, and for the Piston Broke, team captain Rick. Mm. Rick's into uh, trikes and the likes, and fat so are the rest of the bunch. Uh, he's the chairman of the NABD, you know. Oh, yes. And that's the National Association of Disabled Bikers or something like that. Bikers with it? a disability. B bikers with a disability. Good man. Thanks for Rick. OK, Good and Cliff next to him, he's a trike man as well. He's got an Alfa Romeo engine trike. Good Lord. Um, executive uh, production manager or something of the magazine. Oh, right. Yes. That's indeed, eh? Oh, yes. You won't believe it, you can't read and write. <laughs> Does that mean he's a printer? Something like that. Counterfeiter, more like. Yeah, probably, yeah. 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 Martin, don't want to mention it. He's the representative for the same association. Don't want to mention. Band. Does band? <laughs> don't mention it, though. Band. Good job, there's nobody watching, innit, really? Good to see you. That, yeah. that lot, folks, are indeed the piston broke. Yay! 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 This evening, <laughs> Captain Tony, who rides a 554 Honda, I believe, and a CBR 600. You like your Hondas, you I do, don't you, Tony? Yeah. Um, mm. He's a fitter, motor fitter. A fitter, motor fitter. Not like fitter. a mechanic or something. Mm. Similar. Uh, yeah, similar, but yeah. posh. Yeah, a bit yeah, posh. A right, bit more upmarket. Posh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> uh, jo, next to, <clears throat> next to uh, Tony, she's into a custom bike, aren't you, Jo? GS 650 um. custom bike. Um, works at that company, do Caterpillar stuff. No, they don't make Caterpillars. <laughs> no. What are you talking about now? She works for Caterpillar, but don't mention it. Right. And um, once, she's a picker enough. and a packer and things, aren't you? Pick a packer and thing in Anyway, and Brian next to her is a, a, a meter reader, or something like meter reader. What, what really are you, a meter reader? What is it? What's the title? I'm a field services representative. That's why he had to say it, because I can't <laughs> say that word like that. Rides a VF 750. Um, no. That's got no brakes at the moment. I own a VF750. But you're not you using it because you don't I ride a GS650. All right, OK. We've got it all. We know what's going on. That's <coughs> the team, the Forking Calipers. <laughs> We've got that our team, two top teams as usual. All we need now is someone who can work out the scores and keep track of the scores, and here she is, Michelle Lineker. <laughs> 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 Get your leg over yet again. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> hey. She's so sharp. She's funny. Eh? <laughs> it is sharp as she'd cut herself, wouldn't she? Yeah. Eh? Fantastic. She's, she's looking, looking very uh, summery tonight. Summery? Summery. She's got I've been summer. on the holidays. She's got a bingo dress on, haven't you? <laughs> I've you got a return ticket. Eyes <laughs> down looking, eh? Looks <laughs> <laughs> like a full house as well, doesn't it? Some of us anyway. to go away, Wayne. Right, well, that's enough about Michelle. Back to us now. <laughs> OK, Wayne, what are we doing first? First first game tonight is, in fact, Know Your Bike. It is. Gentlemen and madam, what we will need you to do is look at the monitor over there. For those of you who don't know what a monitor is, it's a TV. That's it over there. And on that TV will be, in fact, it'll be a, like a bike picture, won't it, Paul? Like bits of bikes. Bits of bikes. And we want you to tell us what on earth the bike picture is. You're going first at Ricky's Bunch, the uh, the piston broke. Look at the cam look at that monitor over there. Tell us what on earth this motorcycle is. Hmm. Oh, it's only a little bit of it. Stolen. It? <laughs> what orange. It? What did you say, Rick? Stolen and orange. It's stolen. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, go uh, on, give us a go. Mine is it red. Is. I thought I could see a bit of Liverpool in the background. Are you having so a guess stolen. or are you going to have, have a bit more? Do you want to see another picture? Yes, please. Yes, yeah, so let's show them a bit more then. Let's have another yeah. bit, bit more. That's uh, that's the back of the same bike. That's a different bike. No, it's not a different bike. It's no, the, it's same, the bike. same one. Uh, it's the same bike. Careful, you don't fall over there. Is that a crash? Is it a crash? <laughs> <laughs> I, take it, I take it with all these suggestions, you've got no idea well, what I'll it is. Well, I'll tell you what, let's no. have a look at the third picture, see if you know what it is after this. <laughs> I think it's got this, the name written down the fairing. Oh, it's a bike. <laughs> <laughs> is it a Honda, Honda RVF? It's an RVF 400, that's exactly yes. what it is. But uh, not very impressive Just for us now. Sorry, lads, but you so were That's trapped. what they look like. Not <laughs> impressive. Right, uh, Falcon Calipers, same thing. There's a bit of a bike. Have a look at that. It's only a little bit. It could be worth a guess. Are you having a guess, guys? Suzuki. Suzuki, same. Well, we'll show you a little bit more and see if you... Uh, can work it out. What do you reckon? That I reckon them colours give that on. Oh, fire blade. Yeah, yeah, fire fire what did you say? Fire blade. He says, yeah. a, he says a fire blade on two clues. Let's have a look last at the last picture. picture. Let's, let's, let's see what it is. Of course, it's a oh, nice course, yes. urban tiger of fire blade. Course. The only paint on one. They are. Well done. So, <laughs> Michelle. <laughs> not, not 
exactly a high scoring round that was it. The piston broke on five, five miles an hour, straight into the lead. Go the fork and calipers with ten miles an hour. Briefly. Oh, everybody hates the smart ass. Well, it's time for our teams to test their powers of deduction now, uh, powers of cunning, as we play Whose Bike Is It Anyway? What's deduction, then? Deduction. It's yeah. uh, like it's like the multiplication. The adding is it? up. It's is that when you take off things? N no. What are you talking <laughs> about? It's just Michelle. She's always going on about deducing, deducing and deducting things. No, abduction, that's you that going is. on about seducing. And oh, that's it. Right. Really. OK. Shut up, you're arguing. Right. Oh, what's going to happen here is one team is going to read to the other team uh, so the piston broke. Rick, are you paying attention now, Rick? Sorry, Bruce. No, no it's not. <laughs> <laughs> hey, that was funny, that. Uh, right, Rick, you're going to read um, to these, and then um, Cliff is going to read, then Rick is going to read. All you guys are pretending tonight to be uh, Kawasaki ZX6R owners. So, um, Falk and Calipers, you're going to hear three statements about a ZX6R. Only one of them is correct. We want to know which one it is. Rick, fire away. You're sitting comfortably. Oh, stop it. <laughs> <laughs> My new ZX6R is the fastest 600 on the road. OK, that's one statement. Cliff, give him the next one. My ZX6R is the fastest V-twin in the Kawasaki range. OK, I'm... Beautifully done. Wow. Well, Martin, Martin, you do yours. I brought a ZX6R because it's the fastest than a ZX9R. Right. You've heard three statements there, all about a ZX6R. One says it's the fastest 600 on the road, one says it's the fastest V-twin in the Kawasaki range, and one said he bought it because it's, it's faster than a ZX-9. Okay. It's not a V-twin. No, it's, no, it's, it's probably it's orange. So who, who's, who's telling the truth there? Who's nah. You're going no. for Rick. My ZX-6 size the fastest 600 on the road. Rick, is that right? I'm not telling you. It is right. <laughs> well done, guys. Yeah. Very good. Well done, well done guys. You so correct. Correct. You've given them the answers. Well done. No, we haven't given the answers. Yeah. Oh, right, right, you got that. Right, very good. So Fucking calipers. The, uh, the Tony. Six. Right. Tony's going to read the first no. one to you. Pay attention, children. And we're talking here about a Suzuki TL1000R, the new Suzuki. <coughs> Tony, in your own time. Rick, are you ready? Carry on it's uh, my new TL1000R as a V-twin motor. Right, Joe, give me the next one. My TL1000R does over 170 miles per hour. OK, Brian. I bought a TL1000R for its superb V4 motor. Three so then, there. Rick, Cliff and Martin, which one is telling the truth? He wouldn't buy an out, so that's a lie. <laughs> <laughs> He'd never done it. No, he'd never done it. I'm like you. How no Suzuki's ever done over 170? Well, right. Right. Okay. Which one we so which one are we having then? I find it dif difficult to disagree with anybody who's got breasts. We'll have a <laughs> third one, I think. So what are you going, first, we're... second or third? We have an old fella on the end, are we? Yeah. Tony Simple says it has a V-twin motor. Yeah. One of the guys, uh, go for I that. don't think it is. Are you going for that? Yeah, we'll go for the old fellow for sympathy. <laughs> Tony, <laughs> has a V-twin motor, correct or not? True. 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 We'll, we'll, get right. that. we'll get back. We'll get back. Well right. played. Oh, oh, yes. Some points, Michelle. Knowledgeable team, this. Right. right. What that means is the piston broke have now revved up to 20 miles an hour, yes. but still Ended in the lead on 25 miles an oh. hour, the fucking calipers. Hold well on. Uh, right, it's going very well, isn't it, Wayne? It won't now. It won't now. It's no. going all right. Because this is now. Wayne's cabaret now. Cabaret. Wayne's Can out there. Can you describe it as something else? I like this. my favourite bit because Michelle comes and sits next to me. Michelle, would you like to come over here? Uh, I'm bringing my horn. Uh, Michelle's coming here with her horn. Love this. What could be better on a Sunday night? You like them hats? Oh, that's a bit fuzzy, that hat, though. Is it? What about that one? Not yeah. bad. It moved, that one, then. Right. I prefer the bald head, you know what I'm like. Oh, bald, that's where I wear the hat. Right, then, Rick, <laughs> Cliff and Merton, over there. <laughs> I'm going to try and describe, off this card, try. some part of a motorcycle or something related to bikes, and you've got to tell me what on earth I'm describing. This should be fun. Yeah. I'm really not looking forward to this, but I never do because I'm crap at it. So I'm hoping you'll help me out here, lads. Crap at everything. Big time scoring here. Pull me one, will you, Paul, while you're at it? Right then, are we, can I go? You, you can ready? start in your own time, Wayne. Thank you very much. The first one, what am I doing? <laughs> You've let... No, no, not quite. Is this one of the Viagra questions? What is this? What is... Come on, kids. Two in the engine now. Licking the handbag. You've Liberty. got this at the back of the bike and it holds <laughs> a, a wheel in place. 
It's not the front forks, it's at the back of the bike. It's, it's the rear forks. The rear forks. No, it's a, what you, what oh, come on, let's swing call the swing arm. Swing arm, swinging arm, arm. Swinging arm, arm he said, right? Swinging arm, I, yeah. It's not two sides, it's a swinging arm. It's got. Oh, did it? Oh, come on. Never we'll give you that. It's a single sided swing arm. At the back of the bike, you have boy, what are you talking about? If you had a bike and not a trike, you'd have these over the back and you put all your butties in and waterproofs in the back. Panniers. Panniers. Yes, and it's the type you can take off. Removable. Very removable. nice. Well, yeah, 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 yeah. Not the main one in the middle of the bike, but the one side you kick down. Side side, that's it. Lovely, lovely. Um, you have these on the wheels, and you pump the tyre up by this valve. And valve. 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 Yeah. Right, it's nothing to do with the wheels anymore. This is this is how much power. Oh, I said the word <laughs> power. Power valve. Can't have that. Can't have that. Okay. Give us the point Your anyway. motorcycle is. Um, has this over the top to Bearing. keep it you know, rain. You know, all over the top to keep the water rain and the cover. rain off and everything. Bike cover, thanks Four, very much. Three, uh, two, battery. one, oh. six. Oh. 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 That's enough. I can't. Uh, can't we have that 12 volt then? That last no. 12 volt. Yeah. You were well, rubbish. No, we'll give him that. I can't oh, stand anymore. Yeah. Well, it's it's desperate. It's getting a bit violent. Spud gun. Flipping. Right then, fork and calipers. <laughs> right. Please. Uh, I am pretty bad at this, so you've got to really go for it. Get some wild guesses going. All right. On the rear of the bike, the bike goes up and down because it's got these Springs. dampers. Dampers, but they're called something else. Sh <laughs> Shockers. Yeah. Shock. Shock. And they're not filled with air, they're filled with gas. Gas, gas. gas shock. Nice. Well done. Um, on the front of the bike, you have these. Fairing. Some people have different colours. It's the blade, if you call them a blade on some people. On the fairing, you have this on the top of the fairing. Windshield. Screen. 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 And it moves up and down via a switch. Adjustable screen. screen. Yeah. It, it's worked power. An electric power. adjustable yeah. electric screen. screen. Well done. Yeah. At the back of the bike, when you go to stop, Everyone can see you stopping because there Stop is a light. Brake, brake light. Yeah, brake light. Brake light. Well yeah. done. On the front of the bike, you don't have a brake light. You have a headlamp. A headlight, and it's a type of headlight. They have them fire blades. They call it a name. Fox eye. Fox, Fox eye. eye. Yeah. Well done, Tom. Um, the flasher flashes on and off via because there is a relay. Uh, no, the actual the thing that lights up the bulb. Yeah. Indicator bulb. Indicator bulb. Right. Well done. Oh, at the front, you put your feet on them. Pegs. Yeah. Foot at the back, foot rest. You put, yeah. At the back, you have them. At the back, they were called rear pegs. Rear, 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 rear sets. Rear sets. Rear foot pegs. Rear foot pegs is nearly enough. Yeah. Oh, it's a type of Harley Davidson. Well, that's it. Off. Wayne, you're not particularly rubbish. It was like pulling teeth, that wasn't it? That was painful. That. Soz. We had to try and keep score of that. What one of these? Michelle's kept score here. Go on, Michelle. Hit us with it. Some of us can score at least. Right, the piston broke. Lacking along with the spud gun trained on me on 30 miles an hour. <laughs> and the fork and calipers are still in the lead with 40 miles an hour. Oh, very good, well done. <laughs> well, it is time, thank goodness, for a quick break now, but well, we're away. Can you work out this dead easy gran this dead easy granogram? <laughs> this granogram, it's an anagram. And it says it there, it says hit run treacle. Uh, and here's a clue for you. It's the name of a famous racer. In fact, a British superbike racer who's done quite well this year. So we'll tell you the answer in part two of Bikers, Bikers Night, Night Off. Off. In. Now the answer to this uh, this granaram, as I said. Granaram. Granaram. <laughs> Anagram even. Uh, hit rum treacle. Did you know what it was? No, got the foggiest. Well, as always. These guys didn't even bother working it out. It was, of course, Michael Rutter. See? Everyone knew, didn't oh, they? Of course they did, I. Of course yeah. they did, eh? They'll sleep tonight now. Now, this is a game that we have played before. It's called Price Your Parts. Price Your Parts, mm. a simple one, this, isn't it? Helmets it this week, I we think. Need it simple. It is helmets indeed. Mm. A single helmet just to play with, boys. You'll enjoy this. And all you've got to do is uh, tell us how much this helmet is worth. Simple as that. So, if you'd like to pick your helmet up, Piston Broke team, have a little look, see, and tell us what it should sell for in the shops at recommended retail. Oh, yeah. <coughs> Early 14th century, I reckon. Queen Mary's piss pot. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> well, she was a big one. Yeah. 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 They left a knock 50 <laughs> off the visor. So, so, what do you reckon well. then, Jack? We need you to work out a so, price. Do we ignore the scratched visor? Yeah, the, the gooey visor is irrelevant, yeah. yeah. Oh, it has I no bearing on the price at all. It's smart, isn't it? I'll give you a bit of discount if you get it right. You like the vents on the top and all that, yeah. Absolutely. Very nice. Have a snazzy one, I reckon. Got to be between two and two and a half on it. So, go what we're going for, Rick? Come on, give us a figure. Well, our uh, our scouse gentleman says two forty. 
Too, too far. I'm not going to argue right. with that. Too far, too far. Right, Michelle's yeah. made a note of that. Falcon calipers, have a look at your helmet. Uh, and it's a nice blue and white one, isn't it? It's a nice blue and white one. A blue and white helmet. Is it cheaper, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. It's it's cheaper, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. They're having a good day. Uh, Joe's having a good day. She likes that helmet. What do you reckon, Brian? Tony? Joe? Are we going to have a price? What are you saying? It's up to you, Tony. 190. So 240, 190, Michelle. Is that anywhere near? Give us the answers. If we get the price right, can we have them? <laughs> right, no, you can't. Um, basically, the piston broke said it was £240. Mm -hmm. It was, in fact, that little AGV number, £205, so they were £35 out. The uh, Nolan over there that the fork and calipers said was 190 was, in fact, 169 so they were £21 out. So that means that the piston broke are on 40 miles an hour, and again, Screaming yeah. ahead on 55 miles an hour are the fork and calipers. <laughs> well, that wasn't uh, too bad, but uh, I reckon this next game will be will be a bit better. This watch my back. This is good. This is where we find out if they can read. Yeah, yeah. If they can read, because what we're going to do first, uh, piston broke team are going to go first, uh, and you are going to. Um, uh, read um, some clues as to the identity of a bike or something like that. What yeah, am I talking about? I have no idea. You're the doctor's very, home, you It's are. very good, this Vimto, it isn't is it? It is indeed, yeah. Uh, right, so, Rick, you're going to read the first clue and uh, Falcon Calipers are going to try and guess what bike it is. Are they? Yeah, go on, give them a All clue. Right. Read us that top line, Rick. I'll do that. <laughs> uh, this twin cylinder has its own race series. This twin cylinder has its own race series. Are you having a wild guess, guys, or would you like another clue? RVF. RVF is not right, so uh, let's have Cliff giving him the second clue. Go on, Cliff. It's a 500cc. So we know it's a 500cc twin with its own race series. Are you going to have a guess? Or would you prefer a question on sport? They're very, very quiet, aren't they? <laughs> They're very quiet, aren't they? No, no, it's a 500 twin. Yeah, concentrating. Yeah. What, what, what are you saying? Yeah, it's a 500 twin. Well, that's what he says. Yeah, yeah I know. Isn't it's nice to see there's something they don't know? It is nice to see there's something they don't know. I reckon they need another clue. Chop the one, then. I reckon Martin. Another clue. Another clue. Okay. Martin, give him the third one. Its name is just two letters. Its name is just two letters. Just two. Just two. Yeah. Just two <laughs> letters. Long race series. That's right. Uh, are you not going to bother? No, no. Are you going to have a clue? Are you going to have a guess? Which two letters? Well, that's that. <laughs> <coming, laughs> <that's coming laughs> Rick, give him the fourth oh, one yeah. on that card. Go on, right. Out with it's named. It's made by a geezer called Frank. <laughs> no, actually, it says it's made by Honda. But I didn't want to make it too bloody it's easy. It's made by Honda. 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 Yeah. Frank from Honda. Yeah. Yeah. Via. Yeah. What? Oh, no. Why? Why? Are you no, it's not a VF. Piss poor. I hope I have it easier than this. <laughs> no, Rick's not at least I'm impressed I'm with this. Not, not, not at all. all. Cliff, no. give him the next one. It was introduced in 1993. <clears throat> right, let me just recap for you. It's a 500cc uh, twin made by Honda, introduced in 1993, and it's got two letters as its name. So it's something it's something CB. 500. Mm. If you had all these, can't give you any more clues. CB. Something, something, something. CB. 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 Yeah. 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 Well, you didn't say it loud enough. Well done. Good Eventually, love. right, Tony. Like that was a bit of a no, struggle. No, right. 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 no pressure now, lads. But just right, Rick. Pay attention now. It's your turn to have a guess. This is an easy one. I'm never going to get it. No chance. We haven't got all day. We're running out of time now. This is the heaviest bike in Honda range. This is the heaviest bike in Honda's range. That means it's a very big one. Having a wild guess? Hello. The heaviest bike that Honda make? <laughs> Goldwing. Begin, no, begins with uh, an A. What? what was that? What was that? Goldwing, would you like to be a bit more precise? A little bit more precise. The sodding great ass being gay. I think we'll give you a the gold wing. It's on the gold wing. It's well on the door. Oh, one liner. Fuck yeah. you. This yeah. is a completely different. Um, Thing, whatever you call it on it. <laughs> Basically, what that means is that the fork and caliper are now on 65 miles an hour, but they've come from behind, we'll say no more, and are now on Maybe. 70 miles an hour. Whoa. The Fist and Brown! Hey! Oh, I knew it'd be trouble with a sponsor. Yeah, indeed it is. We're actually, uh, we're actually <laughs> very, very <laughs> nearly <laughs> done. Uh, there's a private conversation going on here. <laughs> no, yes. We are all done, but it could all change now as we go into the final round, which is, of course, the home straight. 
Right, so it could all end in tears, eh? Or a big fight. Michelle, do you want to come here? I do, I, like I this do. because Michelle comes amongst us over here. Closely. So. Right, it's uh, dead easy, this, guys. Questions and answers. Piston broke, you're going first. We're going to ask you some questions. Shout the answers out, so I'm sure you'll know all of them. Wayne. Hey, ready, chaps? Give it them. Yes. First one. Name two of the stars in the film Easy Rider. Dennis, Dennis Hopper. Hopper. Um, Jack Peter Nicholson. Jack Nicholson. Yes, well done. well done. We'll give you that one. Yes, you could have also had Peter Fonda. Uh, how mean? many times has Ivan Major been World Speedway champion? Four, five, or six times? Five. Five, he says. It's actually six times, would you believe? Right, yes. yes. Um, which year did wearing crash helmets become compulsory? Was it 1972, 73, or 74? 72. 72. 72. Are we having 72? 72. 72. 72. I'm afraid it was 1973. Oh, oh, yeah, well, look it. In what year was the first Paris Dakar rally? 78, 79, or 80? 80. It was actually 79. Oh, oh, I'm sorry, Cliff. Oh, wrong. All right, in which country is Laguna Seca? Oh, oh, that's the gun. Sars. But they did all right there. You got one right. Have you made a, Michelle, have you made a note of that, Michelle? Right. Have Don't rub it in. Have you made a Michelle of that note? Right then, come on. All right, are you ready yeah. now for fucking calendar? Sure. First question. Go on. Go on. Who wrote a triumph in the Great Escape film? Steve McQueen. Steve McQueen, Steve McQueen it was, not it? Which company make the Quantum-style crash helmet? AGV. No, it's not. Laser. Actually... Ara, I'm sorry, mm. but uh, you were close. Which famous comedy actor once won the famous TT? Oh, uh, Josh Farmer. Josh Farmer! Yeah. 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 Turn that nice again. Right, in which country is the Catalonia racing circuit? Greece. Greece? This is Spain. flipping Spain, Brian! Spain, Spain. 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 Next door. Which company made the CBX model? Honda. Honda. It was it indeed was Honda. Honda. What does ACU stand for? Autocycle Union. Auto He's got this. Oh, if I get one quick in, which company uses Pro Link suspension? <laughs> Just and it's all over. And it's all over, Michelle. And that was Honda. For the first Sorry. time in a very long time, even though both people have done very well, we have a draw! Oh, oh, yes, oh. Yes, 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 yes! Good. Flip it, was that oh, mean they yes. both got to come back? Yeah, yeah. Well, they can both come back sometime, whatever. Anyway, that is it for this week. We're off to the disco now to watch Wayne doing the slosh. Or is it getting sloshed? That'll Something like that, whatever, I don't know. We'll see you next week on Bikers, Bikers Night, Night Off! Off. Yeah.